This resource is a demonstration of how to manipulate SVG properties with bindings and scripts in order to create animations. The demonstration is split into basic, intermediate, and advanced animations with each section building on the previous one. The basic animation is this circle on a grid. If we look at the properties on the right side of the page, we can see that some of those properties are color-coded to match the controls around the grid on the left. Adjusting those sliders will change the position of the circle, the color of the circle, the radius of the circle, or show and hide the grid. The intermediate animation is very similar to the basic animation, but adds rotation around the center of the grid, with a marker showing that center point, a line connecting the center and the circle, as well as an outline of the path that the circle will move. Since there are more components in this SVG, the properties are broken up into three tabs, which have similar color coding as the basic demo, to show how they change with the sliders. Pressing the Auto Movement button will animate the circle rotating around the center mark, and you can still adjust the sliders while the circle is moving to see their effect. The advanced animation is based on similar principles as the basic and intermediate animations, but combines them into a simulation of a robot arm. Since there are so many different moving parts, the properties are too long to show on one screen or in a tabbed container. Instead, you can see the properties and bindings if you examine this view in the Ignition Designer. In this demo, you can adjust the colors of different parts of the arm, as well as adjust four different positions of the robot using the Go To Position button to see that corresponding position in the SVG view on the left. When you select Auto Movement, the robot arm will animate between each of those four positions in an endless loop. The color of each part of the robot can still be adjusted while the robot is moving. 